In this video, we got a gameplay on the new free diamond moments, Drew Holiday and NBA 2K23. My team is going to be a 94 overall point guard shooting guard. He's 6'3", so not a terrible height for the point guard position. I do wish he was a little bit taller because I think in like play now, he's actually 6'4", 6'5", but for some reason, he's only 6'3", in my team, which isn't terrible, especially for a Drew Holiday card. Looking at his stats, though, he's going to have an 88 mid-range, 91 three ball with only a 65 driving dunk. That's probably one of the biggest flaws for the card is going to be that only having a 65 driving dunk, but a 91 three ball and 88 mid range is pretty solid. And then defensively, we know this Drew Holiday card is going to be an absolute beast. 80 block, 88 interior defense with a 95 perimeter and a 96 steal as well. So all around, Drew Holiday going to be a great lockdown defender, especially on the perimeter. And then if we look at the speed, he's going to be super fast. 93 speed, 93 acceleration with a 93 speed of the ball. And then he also does have some good lateral quickness being a 96 and overall good athleticism stats as well. Looking at his badges, he does have six on Hall of Fame, including Deadeye anchor challenger clamps glove pick dodger so some pretty good hall of fame badges on drew holiday and then he also does have 36 on gold including blinders catch and shoot comeback kick green machine guard up limitless range which is really nice to have on your point guard ankle breaker bailout clamp breaker dimer handles for days killer combos quick first step unpluckable ankle braces chase on artist interceptor menace workhorse and then silver hyper drive so all around guys this drew holiday card looks to be a really really good free diamond point guard i do also want to give a massive shout out to mini coach for obviously getting drew holiday on his account and letting me use his uh, letting me use his account for the gameplay but just yeah i want to give a massive shout out for getting this drew holiday card but looking at drew holiday here in freestyle i do want to test out you know his, his movement and his jump shot as well so i know his jump shot is on quick timing but looking at the actual release Okay, it's gonna be super fast. I mean, my first jump shot with these cards is always off, but yeah, okay, that release is actually pretty solid. It's gonna be super fast. That's 100% uh, the thing you can notice right away because I just did a Jeremy Link gameplay and his release was so slow. So this is gonna be a little bit hard for me to adjust. I just gotta get used to a faster release, but yeah, that's a great jump shot for Drew Holiday. His movement does feel actually pretty good. Even though I think he only has pro dribble style, he can actually move pretty well on the court. And yes, he only has a 65 driving dunk, but he can still dunk the ball at a pretty high level yes he's not going to be you know dunking on people but if you need him to dunk in transition or just dunk in general he can obviously dunk the basketball and then does he have the normal leaner he does which is always great to have on your point guard so all around guys i think as a two-way point guard this drew holiday is going to be one of the best free diamond point guards in the game but let's go green one more three and let's get on to the diamond drew holiday gameplay into the clutch i'm online game here with the diamond drew holiday my opponent does have a pretty good squad so we're looking to attack that paint on the first possession as we are going to get an assist with drew holiday on the first play but like i said my opponent does of a very decent team he's got guys like sean kemp i'm pretty sure that's james worthy and he's got bob Cousy at the point guard position we're trying to play great defense look at look at the defense from my man drew holiday getting that stop on the first possession i mean this card he looks to be one of the best point guard defenders in the game as we're looking to go around that screen i do really want to test out a jump shot it did look really fast in the freestyle as we're trying to pull up from the left side corner and we cannot get that to go i mean his jump shot is a little bit inconsistent and i feel like you got to get used to it because it's not the easiest jump shot to green as my opponent he's just going to pull up from way downtown bob Guzzi, unable to get that to go but we gotta start cooking on the offensive end we're looking to go around that screen we're attacking the paint hard look at my man drew holiday even though he only has a 65 driving dunk able to get to the cup and get that kind of layup dunk to go i mean i know he's not going to be the greatest offensive point guard especially going to the basket but he can still attack the rim you know make some contested layups and get those dunks to go but trying to play some good defense here amazing defense from drew holiday he's gonna have to force up a bad shot and we are pushing that ball in transition but i want to start chucking the ball I want to start chucking threes with my man Drew Holiday. He also does have the normal leaner as well. But we're going to find Bob Nedelecki on the inside. Can't get that to go, man. That is just not a great take. And we got to get back here in transition. My pony's got Clyde Drexler as well. We're trying to play some good defense. Got to watch him drive it inside. I mean, that's solid defense. Getting a 10% covered there on James Worthy really isn't that bad. But we got to start cooking on the offensive end as he's almost going to push us out of bound. Can we get that steal? Or can we get the screen here with Bob, Bob Nedelecki? We're looking to attack the paint. Drew Holiday going all the way. And we cannot get this to go. Off to a really rough start here with drew holiday but i have a feeling we're gonna start to cook up man i'm not gonna lie i do have a feeling we're gonna start cooking here with drew holiday gotta play some good defense though great defense we're gonna leave james worthy left wide open he's gonna absolutely brick that and we are pushing that ball in transition come on man we got to start hooping on the offensive end. We got to get something to go. We're attacking the paint with Drew Holiday. He just is not that great at going to the basket. I cannot lie to you guys. I do wish he was a little bit better going to the rim. Like if he had an 85 driving dunk, I feel like that would just make things so much better. As we're looking to find him on the inside though, Drew Holiday able to get that layup to go. He's now got four points and one assist on the ball game. I mean, we all know what he can do on the defensive end. So I want to see him lock up, man. I mean, he's already played great defense on one possession, but we got to see him play some good defense. I mean, right now he has Bob Cousy in an absolute box, almost getting that 
that steal there as well. We are just playing some great lockdown defense. He's forcing up another bad shot. Like Drew Holiday is going to be such an amazing defender. We're finding him out in transition as well, and we're going to get that standing dunk to go. So overall, and Drew Holiday having a great start to this clutch time game. Six points and one assist on the ball game. Looking to play good defense. Not sure what my opponent's shooting, but great defense here from Drew Holiday. Can we find him in transition as that is a terrible pass, I think, from Dr. J. But let me know in the comment section down below, guys. Are you going to be grinding for the Diamond Drew Holiday card? And obviously, the moment said, are you guys going to be completing his agendas? I think it takes probably about, you know, 45 minutes to an hour. I would say probably like the fastest you can do it is about 45 minutes to an hour. Maybe if it takes you a little bit longer, like two to two and a half hours but really not that bad of a grind of all especially for like how good of a card you do get in return which i assume this year holiday i mean after using it for a little bit i can already tell he's going to be one of the best moments cards we've gotten especially in a while so we're going to foul him there from the three-point line with his jordan pool but yeah guys let me know in the comment section down below what do you guys think about the drew holiday card are you guys going to be grinding for him you know let me know where you guys do think he ranks amongst the best point guards in the game i would say he's definitely not top five but top ten I think you could definitely make a case for him being a top 10 point guard in the game just because of his defense and his jump shot as well. But we got to start cooking on the offensive end. We've had kind of a rough start, you know, three point wise. I do want to start chucking up some threes, but my opponent is playing some really good three point defense. We're looking to go for a little normal leaner fade here. We got literally no stamina. and We cannot knock that down as our stamina is really, really low. It's still two minutes left to play. He's going to pull from that four point line with Bob Cousy, unable to get that to go. And we got to push that ball, man. We got to push that ball in transition. I just want to get a three, man. I just want to get a three with drew holiday can we knock it down it's his jump shot is just really hard to time i'm not gonna lie to you guys like i thought his release was gonna be a lot better but it's just really inconsistent and very hard to green his release but we're looking to find him driving all the way to the key and right now he is really cooking at going to the rim I thought he'd be a lot better on the three-point line, but yeah, his jump shot, it just feels super fast, and it's just really hard to time. It's not a bad jump shot at all. It's just really hard to green time it, but we're trying to play great defense. I mean, right now, you guys can see he is absolutely locking up Bob Cousy. We're able to get that steal, and come on, man. Can we finally get a three-pointer here? Maybe it's got to be a normal leaner in the corner because I'm not the greatest with the jump shot. Can we knock down that normal fade, though? And man, we are just chucking up bricks, but I mean, going to the basket and defensively, this card looks to be an amazing point guard. I just know I can green these threes, but great defense with your holiday i can i just knock down a three man i got no stamina so it's gonna be tough to hit a three as we did have a little bit of space there and we're throwing terrible passes man like i'm just not playing great on the offensive end as we're trying to play some good defense gotta watch this sean kemp on the inside and we are gonna block that ball into the basket i mean right now i'm just chucking up bricks on the offensive end for some reason i just cannot time his jump shot i'm not gonna you know record like you know five different games and you know only show you guys where i'm, where I'm hitting my shots like i just for some reason i don't know if it's a drew holiday release i don't know if i'm just playing bad right now but i just cannot knock down a jump shot i don't know if it just like it kind of has like a weird load up animation his free throw release also is a little bit slow as well but i do believe that your holiday card is going to be really really nice especially once you learn his jump shot i feel like once you guys release down he's going to be super nice on the offensive end just for right now for some reason i literally cannot time his jump shot like i just cannot green it we're playing great defense so like great defense once again from drew holiday i mean the card is just playing such good defense and that's obviously what we expected like we knew drew holiday was going to be a really good defender i'm trying to give him some space here we literally got no stamina now he's fouling us and we're gonna have two more free throws at the line so not the greatest gameplay for me i can't even lie to you guys but i just want to show you guys you know the raw footage of what happens when you use your holiday i'm not going to go record like three more games and try to get you guys the best possible you know highlight mixtape or whatever you want to call it for your holiday i just want to show you guys what the card looks like in game and you guys can kind of make your opinions and decisions from there if you want to grind for the card or how good he really is and i will say jump shot wise if you guys are saying oh we can't shoot threes or jump shots terrible just put that on me that was just me playing terrible i wouldn't say his release is bad at all it's actually a very good jump shot for some reason though it's maybe because i was using a jeremy i was using jeremy lynn earlier for a gameplay and his release was like super super slow so maybe that was kind of just messing me up but he does have a good jump shot but you guys are able to see his defense is absolutely amazing and he's a lot better going to the rim than most people would think but for those three pointers trust me guys he's gonna be able to knock down threes he's got that normal leaner which is really nice that was just me playing terrible in the clutch time game but hopefully you guys did enjoy and let me know what you guys think about the diamond your holiday and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace